What's up, Acer Cruisers? Welcome back to the channel. So I am excited because earlier this week, I had posted a picture on the Facebook page, which all you got to do is search H3 Family Vlogs on Facebook and hit that like button or the follow button. Be awesome if you did. But anyways, I posted a picture of Carnival Valor and I said that I know something you guys don't know. There's only a couple people that know and one is involved with the information that I am going to give you and another took a random guess and got it right, which I give props to. But I'm going to go over all of that right now in today's episode. Okay, H2 Cruiser, like I said, I'm going to give you some news regarding Carnival Valor, which isn't really Carnival news. It's more H3 Family Vlogs news, but I'm still super excited to share it with you because earlier this week, I posted a picture of Carnival Valor, and like I said, I posted, I know something you don't know, and I was excited about it, and I'm still excited about it. But before we get into all this information, remember, if you like the content in this video, make sure you smash that thumbs up button below. Also, if you haven't already, there's a red subscribe button underneath this video. If you could be so awesome to hit that subscribe button as we are trying to hit 2,000 subscribers before December 11th when we get on Carnival Panorama for her inaugural sailing. Now, lastly, if you want to show the ultimate support for the channel, anytime you see an ad before or after or during the... Um, our episodes make sure you watch it all the way through do not click that skip now button the longer you watch it the more we make to where we can put back into cruising which is more content and we do appreciate each and every one of you that does support this channel so on to the whole cruising thing and carnival valor uh, before we get into that um, i personally over the last 10 years have done seven cruises starting from carnival paradise in november 2009 and it's crazy. I would have never thought that I have done seven cruises in 10 years. And I'm only 30. So I can't really complain about it. You know, times have been rough up and down and all that. But I get to do what I love and I love it a lot. Who doesn't love cruising? Well, there are some people, but that's besides the point. Now, yes, I am in a parking lot. Yes, it is a hot car. So I'm going to try to make this video quick because I can't run the AC while recording. But... I just had something I've never had before, ever, in my life. Yes, a red straw. No, but seriously, Chick-fil-A! I've waited a year and a half with Chick-fil-A being in Vegas before actually trying it because it was overrated for so long. The police had to come down to every location they opened and, yo, know, direct traffic because it was that bad for months not just one day for months the police had to be out every single day six days a week directing traffic but anyways back to cruising um as you guys know i got carnival splendor booked september 14th uh, december 11th december 14th i got carnival panorama book and then january 4th 2021 i have carnival miracle booked as of right now with my two seven days and the five uh, four days i've done in the past i'm at 34 days so i am a gold card uh holder with carnival cruise lines i'm excited about it my next mission is to get to platinum and as soon as possible the sooner the better i'll feel more accomplished about it i don't know why it just it, it's an honor to be getting so close to the platinum card at 30 years of age so like I said, I got four cruises booked, but it seems that may be changing. Um, in fact, I met on Carnival Miracle back in 2015. It was May 2nd, 2015, Savannah's first cruise, my first seven-day cruise, uh, and also for his balcony room. Uh, I met Chrissy and Seth um, from Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, since then, long story short, we became really good friends. They're subscribed to the channel. Uh, they're going to be on the panorama with us, and they're going to be on my friends and family cruise in 2021. But basically, thanks to Chrissy, next Father's Day, Savannah and I will be on Carnival Valor. You guessed it right. Yep, I'm guessing you kind of guessed it by this point in time in the video, right? So for the very first time ever... I will be cruising out of another port. And same with Savannah. It will be her first time cruising out of another port other than Long Beach. We're going to be sailing out of New Orleans, going to Costa Maya and Cozumel. So not only is it a new home port that I've never been to, it's also two new uh, ports of call 
that I've never been to as well. So I'm super excited about it. Savannah's gonna see uh, more of Mexico and so am I and I'm gonna have content from New Orleans. I'm gonna have content from Cozumel and uh, obviously uh, Costa Maya as well. So I'm super excited to bring that to you guys. But on top of it, there is a small possibility that in September, I may be back on Carnival Imagination again for the second time ever. Savannah won't be with me because she's got school. I can't pull her out for that when she's already being pulled out for Panorama and she's already being pulled out for the Miracle in 2021. That is 10 days for kindergarten pulled out and five days pulled out for first grade. I can't do that throughout the year. And as the channel grows, I will be mostly booking cruises on weeks I don't have her during the school year and any cruises in the summer are when I'm going to book on weeks I do have her so she will still be sailing but with that said savannah's five years old she will be completing her fifth cruise two days before her sixth birthday and as of right now she has four cruises booked from now till uh january 2021 that is insane she is going to new levels with this uh, she's still about one a year <laughs> even though she's doing two this year but um, guys, if you've been on Carnival Valor, if you've been to uh, Cozumel, if you've been to um, Costa Maya, let me know what you think about all three of those or any or whatever. Leave your comments below. Let me know the good uh, experiences you've had. Let me know the bad experiences you've had. I want to know it all because I want kind of a heads up before I go down there. And, you know, it's happening. Either way, I'm excited about it. I'm going to get to bring you the content, but I want to try to bring you the best content. So your comments below are going to help me out a lot. So leave them. Awesome, right? Other than that, guys, um, I think if I do, like I did the math, if I do Imagination in September, which is not for sure, but if I do that along with the Valor and along with everything else that's booked, that will put me from current 34 days at uh, sea that I have right now all the way up to 65 days. That puts me 10 days shy of Platinum right after I turn 32. I'm pretty impressed with myself, honestly. It's, it, it's, I feel special. You know, I've worked hard. And hopefully that will grow a lot faster over the time with your guys' help um, and support in this channel. Other than that, guys, I'm out. I don't want to go too long. I'm dying. I need to turn the AC on. And this is why I didn't turn the AC on. Because it's super loud in this car. So, other than that, guys, let me get the AC on. Let me get out of here. I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Take care, everyone. Have a great 4th of July tomorrow. Because uh, that's tomorrow. Yes, 4th of July. I was about to jump out without saying happy 4th of July. Um, I'll be back tomorrow just to say happy 4th of July on 4th of July to you guys with Savannah. So that's it, guys. I'm out. I'll see you next time. Take care.